I wanted to do a follow-up on my previous video talking about how your Wi-Fi probe requests from your Wi-Fi card on your phone and computer are constantly looking for your saved networks, which leads up to possibly giving away your home address. Because there are places like Wiggle.net, which maps out every single uh, SSID for Wi-Fi networks, and because of this, you can easily search for this. So I went ahead and I actually wrote a uh, Python script as a demo for you guys, and I'm actually going to upload it after this video to uh, show my appreciation and to also demonstrate privacy through a privacy compromise example. So a lot of people, you know, have their SSIDs. They don't think much about it. They don't realize it can actually come back and give away their address. So I have this script running right now. What it does is it listens to all of these requests. So what you see here is the client here is looking for this and it's of course blurred out because this is all live information. So we have this constantly running and you'll see it continue to scroll up new saved networks. And I can tell these clients are looking for those saved addresses. I also added it to show the device brand name, so the MAC address for the clients. I have it so it returns their brand name as well so you can get a better idea. Say you have a burglar trying to get into your home. He's got a mask. You can't identify him. Well, if you have this running, you will have a better chance of identifying him because he may be sending you his home SSID. And from there, I have it so when you hit Control C, you simply hit that once and you can search up. I have another prompt I added for you to search for the addresses, the GPS locations, and the street addresses for any SSID that you type in. So let's go ahead and just type in public. Of course, it'll probably return a ton. Let's pretend the SSID we're interested in is public. And then it searches the database and will return all networks, name that, and their location along with GPS. I also have added logging to this. So everything you search for, anything of interest, goes into your log and you can then refer to it later. And after you're done with a search, it asks you to press enter to return to probe watching. Well, when we press enter, it returns us right back to watching the close by Wi-Fi clients looking for their saved networks and trying to connect. So keep this in mind. Turn off Wi-Fi. And a solution I have for you is to log into your home router as administrator. Change the SSID. Very simple solution. Delete previously saved networks. And now you will have an entirely new SSID identity. So that works. It actually works on right here. We're logged into a single board computer because I have multiple Wi-Fi cards there. See, you need one Wi-Fi card to use the full functionality. You need one Wi-Fi card willing to listen in in monitor mode. And then you need another one to connect to the database to search for the SSIDs of interest. So I actually have tried it. It actually works on the Pine tab and should on the Pine phone because it's the same hardware. So let's go ahead and show how to get started. So the issue here is I only have one Wi-Fi card on the Pine tab, so I won't be able to look them up, but I will be able to show you that you can put the card at least in partial functionality, radio tap mode. Let's go ahead and do that with Airmon NG start. And of course, we've got to kill a couple processes. And that should get rid of that issue for us. So I've also done this modification, and I'm going to go over that in a video. I've done a tutorial. I've added, I have an internal SDR card. And now I have a, I put a new threaded port here. So you can put on any cords and antennas you want to use for the internal software-defined radio. And what's really neat is it actually fits inside of the keyboard case. So that's a neat part about it. So it's it's a pretty discreet SDR actually. So as you can see, it's actually inside the keyboard case and you have 
a great little software defined radio kit very compact very nice neat i love the pine tab so far 